So, um, I got a new phone after three years of having the iPhone 4. Came out just yesterday. It's the iPhone 5S. And I'm gonna do an un unboxing video for the 5S, which is this thing is. I've opened the box once before, but it's like to see it and take it out and feel it when I was in the store buying it. And this thing is a beast. I got space gray. It looks really good. Like if I try to move it from all angles, you'll, you kind of see the reflections. The camera, kind of, yeah, you can kind of see it in, when the lights on it. The camera's nice. It's dual flash. I was seeing the examples in the store. It runs an LTE. It's got the iOS 7, which they had a patch for. They had a bug fixes. Um comes with earbuds, pretty average, charger, uh, cable, and um, I'm going to see how well this thing performs for everything else, and I'll be right back. So I just unboxed this a while ago, and I set up the iPhone, and I installed a few apps on it. And holy crap, this thing it installed Modern Combat 4, installed 2 gigabyte app, and like, I had the actual app installed on my computer, but it, the download speed for it, it installed it in a minute and a half. So, um, here we go. iPhone it has the touch unlock. It's so nice. And, um, Asbit is spamming me. So, these are apps. You get iMovie free. You get, um, here, let me just try to make this look better. Here you go. So, you get iMovie free. You get iPhoto free. You get Keynote and Remote free. Um, there, there should be more free apps. I'll, I'll put the, a link for those in the description. Um, for Modern Combat 4, I've played a few matches. The thing, it, it doesn't lag at all. Even when you use a suppressor, some people think, oh, the suppressor has slower fire rate. The compact with the suppressor, same fire rate. It's really overpowered then. Um, so what else? FaceTime, Uvu. Uh, the camera. Everyone wants to see the camera. I was taking some photos of my sister. Okay, so I'm um, slow mo. So I, I'm gonna try to see if I could take a photo of a photo, photoception. So I'm gonna start like moving this phone. I can't really. I'm gonna just move my finger really fast in front of it. Let's see if it. Okay, let's see. Let me just. I'm gonna hold this iPad in a really weird position, trying to make it so it records better. Okay, let's focus in. Here we go, it looks much better. Okay, let's turn this because I was holding the phone this way. I'll tell you when it starts slow mowing. Or is it slow mowing already? It's already slow mowing. And if you saw how fast I was um doing that. Slow mo camera is really nice. Even though the lighting is because I had my finger right by the the flash. Which you can now use flash during videos. I don't know if the older phones could do that because I had a four, but this thing is really nice. So um delete that. Other options, oh my sister. Oops, let's move that way. So, she's very derpy. Uh, video, fo normal photo, which for the normal photos you could, um, you could change all these things. Here, I'm going to focus in more. You could change all these, um, while you're taking a photo. So, like, I wanted mono, I could just click that, I get mono. If I wanted to take it this color, just change the color a bit. If I wanted to take it a bit process, let's, yeah. So, so far, this, um, this phone has outweighed my expectations, and everyone loves panorama views. Uh, let's move my legs along with that phone. It's kind of hard, but, um, I failed. It's going to be a horrible panorama. It's going to be impossible to see, too. Let's see, yeah, it's, it's hard to see. You can't really see it at all. It's really dark in the photo. But, yeah, um... My sister again, she's being a derp. 
this phone so far the the graphics the the performance the loading speed for the internet everything has outweighed my expectations the processor I, I was trying to load it against my dad's galaxy it's I don't know if it's just like the internet that might be but we're like it's the same exact speed so it's really good um iOS 7 stuff like iTunes radio and new Siri like hello Siri hello there okay um what is it Crosby's thing um search Crosby 87871 Yes, search the web, Siri. Search the web for Crosby. Okay, I found this on Look at that. Fear Kryptonite. Uh, what is this? I don't know what that one is. Crosby8771 on Twitter. And, yeah. Um, other source, Twitter. Let's see. I couldn't find any tweets for Crosby87871. Oh, okay. Well, yeah. Um, Crosby. Yeah, you could use Siri for more stuff, and it's pretty cool. Okay, bye. Google Mr. OMG WTF Hacksaw. Searching Google for Mr. OMG WTF Hacksaw. Whoa, look at that fail. What the hell is this? <laughs> yeah, okay, um. Search Mr. OMG WTF Hacksaw. I don't want to quit Siri. Search Mr. OMG WTF Hacksaw. Here's what I found on the web. Well, all these things, Siri is still, um, pretty stupid. It's more reliable. You could, like, go through tweets and stuff now. You also, um, change the, change the, um, what is it? General Siri. The voice. Language. Hello, Siri. Hi there. Yep. There's the uh, male Siri. Hi there, says Siri. Well, yeah, so um, this phone so far is it's a beast. Like everything I've tried it for, which is mostly just modern combat, and I I was playing I was in an Uvu call while in modern combat. The, it was amazing. Um, for video streaming, uh, I'll go load a video from YouTube. I'll load one of my videos. Uh, let's skip. Just search up my videos. Because I haven't actually opened YouTube. Because I just set this up. Mr. OMG told you. Axelor. Let's see. Channels. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Look. God damn it. Asbit. God damn it. Asbit. God damn it. Silent. Oh. Oh yeah. I have to render something for you. Um. Yeah. 207 subscribers. A lot of videos, though. Activity. Oh, yeah. Watch that trailer. It's amazing. Videos. Yeah, so, so let's just, I say I'm going to watch Hackers Exposed. Let's see how fast this loads. It's a really small video, though. I don't know if it's going to be any any good, though. Because YouTube usually is not the best for streaming. Let's see. I guess not. Oh, wait. Now, I'm pretty far away from my, my Wi-Fi box, and that video already loaded completely. Um, and by really far, uh, how many feet would this be? I don't know how many feet, but it's it's pretty far away from my Wi-Fi box. Usually with my with my 4, I would have like one bar of connection here. And I'll show you how many bars of connection I have. I still have two bars of connection here when I only had one bar of connection with my 4. But yeah, that's um 5S. This thing is a beast. I recommend you buy one if you can, have, and you have the money. I'll just show you again the fingerprint. You just unlock it. Um. Also, actually, I will show you how to set up the fingerprint thing. Put. Okay. So where is it? I think it's general passcode lock and fingerprint. Uh, no, not time zone.
back. I'm gonna put that in. Okay, so fingerprints. I have two fingerprints for, for both my thumbs. If you just want to add a fingerprint, I would just go like this. I put my finger there. Just keep on putting your finger down over and over. And it, it just keeps on reading your finger over and over until it gets a, a good read for it. And you have to change your where your angle of your finger. Come on, finish up, finish up, you're almost done. Continue. So, um, now, if I lock my phone again, I'll just show you that it is locked, and it, it's locked, but then when I put my finger on it, the new finger I just scanned, it unlocks itself. So, so far, this phone has been amazing. iMovie and Photo Translate. These apps, if you look in the App Store, it's like $5, $7. You get these apps, but you get them all free with the new phone. Um, See, so yeah, that's my um, my review for the new iPhone. It's a beast. I recommend you check it out, or like maybe just go to an Apple store. I don't know what I mean by check it out. Buy one, cause it's cool. Yeah, so that's my um my iPhone unboxing review thing. Let me just focus in on some of the actual stuff, cause I probably could have focused a bit better later or uh, earlier, but. Yeah, that's uh, the iPhone 5S. Bye.